the reapply tool has received an update in version 1.9, which now allows it to auto match both sides of a panel decal. So, if you have a different material on each side of a panel, you don't need to use the material match tool anymore to figure out which side of the panel is which, and then manually set each side accordingly. Just select the panel, run reapply, and decal machine will figure it out for you. Here is another case, select the decal, reapply, and both sides are properly matched. So this one doesn't seem to auto match for some reason, both sides stay red. If you come across a case like this, you need to follow along the panel decal, and see if there's a part of it where both sides should in fact be red. And that's the case here at the beginning. So for now, you'll have to cut the panel and separate it. Then, reapply again. Next, this tiny decal here, also doesn't seem to auto match properly. The reason this time is, it's a mirror instance, and the original object is sitting on a red material, and so is matched correctly. What you can do now is remove the mirror along the y-axis, and move a copy of the original decal to the new location. What I'm doing instead is, using the real mirror tool in Mesh Machine, to create separate objects from mirror mod instances. Then, just reapply the new decal object. And, instead of reapplying all of these decals manually, I'm now selecting all this object's decals, and reapply them all at once. As before, this one has to be split apart again. While this feature seems like a small addition, it's a real time saver in the long run. And that is despite the fact that the material match tool itself has received a new related feature that helps identify the materials on each side of a panel decal.